An all points bulletin out for a couple on the run tonight. Mobile County Sheriff deputies say Lauren Finney and Colton Ketchum are suspected in a gruesome Centronelle murder. Our Shelby Myers is joining us live now from the Sheriff's Office tonight, uncovering some new details. Shelby, what did you find out? Well, Anise, both Finney and Ketchum have been booked in Metro before, but never for anything as serious as murder. Now, tonight, deputies want to put them back behind bars for allegedly striking Edward Rivers with an SUV, dragging him, taking off, and leaving him there to die. A raccoon hunter making a gruesome discovery on Coy Smith Highway in Citronelle this morning. What was believed to be a hit and run, you know, or leaving the scene of an accident involving a pedestrian. When the troopers got there, began working the wreck, it was determined that it was an intentional act. Captain Paul Birch with the Mobile County Sheriff's Office says 41 year old Edward Rivers was barely alive when first responders got to him around four this morning. He was airlifted to the hospital, but didn't make it. Investigators believe he was intentionally hit by an SUV, dragged 30 to 40 yards from his mother's house and left to die. The suspects, investigators say, are boyfriend and girlfriend, 27-year-old Lauren Finney and 19-year-old Colton Ketchum. According to uh, a witness, that there was a verbal, heated verbal dispute over some property and uh, that Mr. Rivers had purchased from Ketchum. That escalated and then it ended up with Mr. Rivers getting run over hit and killed. Both Finney and Ketchum are from Mount Vernon and no stranger to Metro Jail. Finney has spent about 10 months there since 2016. Her most violent crime, assaulting a Sarah Land police officer. Court documents say in 2016, when an officer pulled Finney over, she took off when he came up to her window and injured him. And again, if you know where Finney or Ketchum are tonight, turn them in. Live in Mobile, Shelby Myers, Fox 10 News.